Well, the good news is that the Atlas and Flare studies both demonstrated that long-acting injectable cabotegravir plus wolpiferine given every four weeks was not inferior to continued oral therapy. So that means that people who don't want to take pills, somehow can't take pills, or somehow would prefer not to take pills, now have another option for maintaining virologic suppression. The studies did differ a little bit because one of the studies took people who had been on treatment for years, and the other one took people who had just recently started treatment, but the results were essentially the same. The only possible caveat to the study was that in Three patients in both of the studies did develop resistance to the treatment, even though they were adherent to the treatment. This just shows that no treatment is 100% effective, and it's just something we're going to have to keep an eye on as we go further.